Hi, and welcome to the Mashbooth app. Today, I'm going to provide a brief tour for the Mashbooth app and how it can be used as a photo sharing kiosk for your event photography or photo booth business. To start off, I'm here at the login screen. If this is your first time using the app, you'll be prompted to sign up for a new account here, and you'll be sent a confirmation email. Be sure to check your spam or junk mail folder if you don't receive it. So now, I'm going to log into the admin account and type in my username and password. This brings me to the admin panel. On the left up here is a preview button. This allows you to preview how your kiosk will look after you have updated your settings. The events button is where you will assign the specific iPad to the events that you have created in your settings. You can also click inside any of these events to make any in-app changes to your event settings if needed. The profile button here is where you will manage and purchase your subscription to the Mashbooth app. The app is free to use for emailing, but if you want to unlock the social sharing features or plan to use this app without the Mashbooth branding, you will need to upgrade here. And finally, down here is your settings button. This brings me to your general settings and it's where you will manage everything that you want your guests to see in kiosk mode. Here is where you will be linking your default Dropbox folders, custom overlays, and set up social media sharing options, emails, and text messaging. One more important thing to point out, over here at this events tab is where you will create your events. This automatically copies over the settings from your general settings tab, but this is where you will customize any settings that are specific to each event that you have. Also, when your event is over, you will be able to obtain valuable sharing data and download email phone number lists here. We will show you how to do all this in a different video. Now, I'm gonna press the home button of the iPad. Open up the Mashbooth app, and I'm gonna click on this little door icon towards the bottom to exit out of the admin panel. I'm gonna tap on continue to user mode. Now, this is the actual screen your guests will see. Guests can tap on any tabs up here and view their photo strips, single photos, or GIFs. They can also see these photos in tile view or full screen view. So I'm just gonna go back to tile view and tap on any of these photos. As you can see, now these share buttons automatically appear and it gives me the option to share these photos on social media or email or text message them. I can also tap on the make GIF button up here and it lets me make a branded GIF in square or original format adjust speed, and save the GIF. And that's pretty much the entire Mashbooth app. As you can see, it's a very powerful tool that any photo booth or event photography business can use to share photos. Be sure to watch our other videos on how to configure the settings of the Mashbooth app and get started in using it at your next event. Mm -hmm.